Hi guys, welcome to Simply Scuba. Here we have the Aqualung Rogue BCD. So this is the bigger brother to the Outlaw that came out in, uh, in 2017. Uh, it's a completely modular BCD. So instead of just having a small, medium and large version, you assemble it yourself so you can have a large shoulder strap if you've got broad shoulders you can have a small back plate if you're not that tall you can really custom make this bcd so it fits you perfectly so instead of having to if you're very tall you have to suffer with a very big or sort of baggy uh, bcd you can just buy a big back plate and then sort of adjust the uh, the shoulder straps and the uh, the waistband to your size. It's completely customizable, very quick and easy to fit. It took me about two minutes to put together, very quick and easy. Uh, and you can disassemble it as well. All you need is like a flathead screwdriver or a key, uh, something very easy um, just to disconnect all the little um, sections, which also means because it's modular, if something goes wrong, if you ever sort of wear out a strap, you can replace just that strap instead of the entire BCD. So it's very economical for a long-term um, sort of BCD. What they've done with the uh, with the Rogue is they've beefed up the Outlaw. Instead of just daisy chains, they've got um, sort of metal D-rings now. You've got a bit more padding on the back plates. It's got more lift as well. It's just got that, it's just beefed up a little bit more. But if we take a closer look, starting up over the shoulders, so we have our corrugated inflator hose that's held in position uh, by a little webbing strap that clips on. Um, so that's gonna keep it uh, just over your shoulder. Down there, down to the inflator, uh, squidgy gray button inflates and then the black button on the tip is gonna deflate. And you also have that oral inflation valve so you can already inflate your BCD. If you do grab hold of that and pull it down from the shoulder, that's gonna open up the, uh, the dump valve over your left hand shoulder. And that's a very quick, easy way to dump some gas when you're first going down. If you're still upright, you can ditch some gas really quickly. Underneath that, we have some daisy chain uh, sort of webbing. So a little clip off point so you can attach things uh, up there. But below that, we have a pre-bent metal D-ring. So pre-bent just means that the bottom is lifted away from the strap a bit. Um, so you can clip off, you can get hold of it a bit easier. It's not completely flush with the strap. And underneath that, we have these hinged um, sort of clips and this is the main adjustment for your shoulder strap, very quick and easy to, uh, to adjust. And, uh, and to undo, you just push on that, uh, that circle in the center to, uh, to disconnect it. But because it's a circle, it means that it's nice and ergonomic. That strap can come in at whatever angle is most uh, comfortable. Across your chest, you have a one-way adjustable pinch clip uh, that just holds the shoulder straps from slipping down over your shoulders. Uh, on the right hand side, we do have a right hands over the shoulder pull dump. Uh, this attaches to the bladder uh, with a little clip. Well, I'll show you that when we spin it around. Grab hold of that, pull that down over your right hand shoulder. That's gonna dump gas uh, when you're upright or, uh, or horizontal. Again, more daisy chain and a pre-bent uh, stainless steel D-ring. That same um, sort of hinged uh, clip on that. The back plate is, uh, is padded and meshed, uh, a lot like the, uh, the shoulder straps. So nice and lightweight, but you do get that nice sort of padding, so it's very comfortable. It also dries pretty quickly as well. So if you're doing multiple dives in a day, it's nice and comfortable. Moving down from that, we get to the waistband. Uh, so the waistband, you can see are on these hinges. Uh, this is the main attachment point, how you attach each of the, um, the uh, sort of the parts to the back plate. Uh, but when it's in position, on the right hand side, we have a, a loop for your octo. Uh, so you can push the, uh, the hose for your octo in that. The second stage stays just on your hip, so it's, uh, it's easy to find. It's quick release, just grab onto that second stage, pull it, or, uh, pull it out, and, uh, and your body will be able to use that. Underneath that, we have a roll down pocket, uh, which bellows out as well. So a fairly decent size. Uh, for a wing style BCD, you get a decent size pocket on that. Velcro closure and that mesh down at the bottom so it doesn't fill up with water. Uh, it tucks away nice and neatly. So if you don't need a pocket, you're nice and streamlined. In front of that, this D-ring attaches to that, uh, that waistband, so the adjustment, so it stops it from flapping around, uh, and then you just pull on that to, uh, to tighten that strap, so very quick and easy. Uh, and then down at the bottom, we have a stainless steel D-ring that attaches to the back plate, not this um, sort of side waistband, uh, but you can clip things off onto that. 
Moving on to the other side, we have knife grommet on this side, so you can attach a BCD knife uh, onto that. Uh, the underside of that uh, is where you attach uh, the screws for those grommets. And again, you get another drop down pocket, exactly the same as the far side. Okay, turning the, uh, the BCD on its side, uh, you can see we have these elasticated bands and these are holding the, um, basically when you deflate the wing, they're gonna scrunch it down and keeps it nice and streamlined uh, when you're in the water. So you don't have all this material just sort of flapping around. It kind of rolls it in and tucks it in on itself um, so it stays nice and neat. Uh, but what I really want to show you is how you attach weight systems onto this. So you get the, uh, the main quick release weights clip into these two little clips here. And if you need some extra weights, you can clip it onto that um, little attachment point as well, the trim weight system. So they won't be dumpable, but it just means that you can add extra weight to the system and you can move it around uh, so it's not, not all um, sort of down on your hips. At the back of the BCD, uh, so over the left hand shoulder, this is your uh, inflator. That's the little uh, retainer strap that holds it in position. Uh, nice low profile, nice and smooth uh, dump valve on that. Very low profile dump valve over the right hand shoulder. This is the little bayonet clip that attaches the, uh, the shoulder strap. So you can disconnect that uh, from the bladder. Great for traveling, so it doesn't all have to go all uh, sort of as one big lump in your bag. You can disassemble it and then reassemble it at the dive site. Moving down at the, uh, the top, we have a little tank valve or a grab handle. You can either uh, sort of wrap this around your tank valve um, just to uh, sort of back up that, um, that uh, cam band. It's got a little pinch clip as well, so it's uh, really quick and easy to use, or you can uh, sort of use that as a bit of a handle just to, uh, to carry your, um, your system around. Now, as you can see, the bladder of the BCD will wrap around your cylinder, hold it in position, stop it from twisting and turning, so you don't need a, a really comprehensive um, back plate on this system. But most of the buoyancy is moved down from your shoulders, so the buoyancy will be down towards your lower back. That will hold you nice and, uh, and trim in the water. The cam band is their, um, their special cam band. Instead of a traditional uh, sort of webbing loop that you have to thread through um, sort of three times, this is a two-part metal buckle that you can adjust with Velcro if you're changing the different um, sort of size cylinders. Uh, wrap it around the cylinder, and then when you're uh, ready to clamp it on, you just close the strap and it will pause at this point. So it's not completely closed, but it's gonna hold onto the cylinder. That gives your, uh, your hand a minute to get all your fingers clear, make sure everything's sort of ready. When everything's clear, push it down and that will lock your cylinder in position. Down from that on your right hand side, another low profile uh, sort of overpressure valve and dump valve. Grab hold of that um, little toggle and pull that down and that will activate that kidney dump. So all in all, it's a beefed up version of the Outlaw. Uh, it's a travel BCD. Uh, it's, got, uh, it's got more lift, it's got more sort of extra features that come as standard. Uh, it's a little bit tougher. You can still use it in the UK, but it's nice and light for traveling as well. So it's a good sort of all rounder uh, BCD, but the main selling point is that customizable you can change the size of your shoulder straps you can change the size of the back plate you can really customize the bcd so it fits you perfectly and this is the aqualung rogue bcd thanks for watching and safe diving we are an online dive store serving the uk and the world for all your diving equipment needs so why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen